there. So, one of the things I want to test out today, this, I don't want to test out how Nescafe Classic tastes because I know already, but I always carry two or three of these in my pack because uh, they're quite sturdy bags. I would suppose it's a Mylar bag, like for any other food storage and so on. <coughs> but uh, I carry them because they're pretty airtight and so on and you will be you, you can use them for a lot of stuff. Collecting water and uh, you can collect uh, small tinder and fire starter materials in the <coughs> in this bag and so on and it will be keep dry and uh, it's good as a dry bag to throw your phone in them and uh, what not so uh, I was thinking about if it was possible to actually boil water in these bags because I've noticed that some mylar bags they're quite difficult to burn <laughs> So uh, it would be quite awesome if it's possible, and I'll try to do it over some embers, not over some straight flame. And uh, the idea I got from about 20 years ago, I was a young restless apprentice during the winter in a plumber blacksmith firm, and uh, I was sitting in this the working wagon, I don't know what to call them in English. Shit, oh, no, not a shit, but you know, these portable living quarters or breakfast, lunch quarters for when you're working here. Yeah, right. And I was sitting there drinking coffee, I just cleaned and oiled the tools and so on, and uh, the older guy was sitting and sleeping and I you was know, sitting drinking my coffee and these, you know, these plastic cups, thin white plastic cups. And uh, then I got uh, destructive and I took uh, my lighter because I was smoking at the time, unfortunately. I took my lighter and hold this coffee with my hot tea and then I started just to burn the bottom of the cup to see whenever it will melt and pour out, but to my big surprise it didn't melt at all and I tried to burn, to melt it in the edges and so on but of course the, the hot tea was uh, cooling the thin plastic enough so it wouldn't boil the question is if this will boil when the bubbling is start, if the, where the bubbles are coming if that will actually make the, the bag melt but anyway I'll test it out, and in the one side I have spruce, and on the other side I have some hardwood, so I'll try to use the coals from the hardwood to, to heat some water up on. So let's see if I can get this going with my Mora fire steel. Would be possible. Who knows? Whoops! That's not so good. I have some uh, spruce stuff here. Might be a bit overkill, but in the winter, you never know. It's also good to take some of the thicker pieces 
Spruce bundle, and we should be pretty ready to run roll. So, coffee bag with some water in it, and I'll use the coals down there. And uh, yeah, just let's see what's what's gonna happen. <laughs> I never tried this before, but uh, let's see. So. Hanging there. So, 15.35. It's been on for a minute's time or something. 15.42. I don't know with you guys, but I see steam coming up from the bag. It's actually held up longer than I would expect it to. <laughs> so, 46. There's definitely steam coming out of the bag. I can actually hear it start to say some sounds down there. You can see most likely bubbles at the bottom and the particles are starting to surface. How much is in there? 300 milliliters or something. 300-400, but uh, it doesn't look like the bag have any damage or something at all. Or maybe a little bit over there here in the corner. There's definitely something going on down there now. 51. Uh, it's been taking a while. Of course, but it's still going strong. 56. We're not boiling yet. That's quite amazing. I never thought it would live that long. I'm actually quite positive you can boil water in these. I don't know how many times, but uh, I'm of course taking care. But I think if you have more embers, I'll put some more over. Uh, I think it would be no problem. Some funny sounds coming out of it. I added quite a, some wood there. I don't know if you can hear it. It sounds funny. It's been there for a while. How long has it been there? 20 25 minutes? The bag is on fire and leaking. Leaking a little bit. There's leaking water there. Well, I also ramped it up well. Take it off and have a look. It's leaking a little bit there. So here's what the bag looks like on the inside. No problem at all. So it's leaking a little bit there. It looks pretty intact. There it's a little the corner there is a little bit soft. The other corner here is not soft, so so if you don't make too many flames and have a nice bed of coals, you can definitely boil water in them. I'm almost sure. Or well, anyway, you can pasteurize your water. So, but I think I'll make an experiment again sometime. But uh, anyway, fun to do.